I've spent a lot of time looking out of hotel windows, seeing the trees concave when that Colorado wind blows. Hey guys, today's video is gonna be a more laid back one. So today's just gonna be more of a chill video, just kind of showing like what a lazy day in my life, aka most days. Because I really don't ever have lots to do. It's very rare that I'm gonna have a video where I'm actually doing shit because that's just life and I've come to realize that I don't have to do crazy shit every single day to have a good time. I'm trying to actually be good at spending time with myself and having fun being alone because it doesn't have to be a bad thing. Um, yeah, so today's just kind of a reflecting day. It's also a shower day because we need, we, we need a shower. But yeah, so I went to um, HomeSense and I went to Bed Bath & Beyond today. I got myself some cute notebooks. So this is what you saw me writing in at the beginning. Um, I'm trying to do journaling. I've tried it before, like just freehand, just writing my day and it just, it's not that fun. <laughs> so that's why I got this book from HomeSense and it's just like a little, I don't even know, but it's basically just a journey of reflection. That's what it says. Um, or a journal of reflection. And so it has three pages um, that you write in. So when you wake up, you write your to-do list and how you're gonna achieve that. The second one, you reflect on your goal, on how you achieved it. And then you can also answer questions like what you're proud of for yourself, what do you need to forgive yourself, what did you learn today, and what's like the thing you're gonna remember. Remember? And then later tonight, I'm gonna do the look into the future, which is talking about how I feel about tomorrow, what I'm excited about, what I'm nervous about, what I want to learn, and how I'm feeling. And some people might think this is just stupid, but I'm trying to like actually get more in touch with myself. I feel like I'm either really happy or really depressed, and I'd be, I want to get to a point where I can be a balanced, balanced amount of both, like a normal person. And then I just got this, just a cute little, it's a cute binder. And it just says grow at your own pace and it has a bunch of plants on it. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with this one yet, but we'll do something with it. And then I also, guys, guys, let me just, look how cute, guys. Look at that. So I got these two pillows, or these three pillows, these ones, today. And then I also got, those are my messy clothes there. I also got this, um, this rug. Oh, we have Bob over there. Keeping watch, you know. There's Bob. I also want to show you. This is my keychain. Um, look at her. She's beautiful. And then she came with like this for your driver's license and everything, and an AirPod case, and like two other things. But I don't know where they are. Um, I'm gonna. I'll put the girl who makes them right here. But I found her from TikTok, and she makes like show-inspired keychains. Like this is. It's supposed to be like jewels from Euphoria or Cassie. It's one of theirs. I don't know. And it's currently 5:20 right now. That's Taylor Swift, my girlfriend. Um, I'm just gonna journal a bit more. I wanted to read, but I kind of just want to watch TV. I'm watching Agents of, Sh of Shield. But yeah, so today is just gonna be a very chill. Um, hang out with me, I guess, kind of type of video. So I'll see you guys in a little bit whenever I do something else. Okay, guys, so I've showered. <laughs> the grease is gone, but now I forgot that I'd have to show you guys me looking like this. Um, I'm gonna keep my skincare simple today, aka non existent, because I just don't have the time and I don't want to. Um, I don't feel like doing the whole ice roller and everything, so. I'm just gonna use my travel size sample of Cetaphil and it's super super sensitive because I'm super super sensitive um, Also guys, yeah, it's been a couple of hours. It's actually now currently 1126 So um, Yeah, so I basically took a nap after that last clip and now I had dinner Now we're here. But yeah, I want to show you guys my hair stuff because I got some new things. Today I'm going to be using my new diffuser which is the, uh, the Diva Curl. It's like a little claw and I've seen lots of people use it especially lots of people with curly hair. So 
and I thought it would help my hair situation. And then I've been using this for a while. It's just the Shea Moisture Smoothie thing. Um, and my hair is normally, like it's naturally um, more on the wavy side than like an actual curl um, mixed with some curls, but I used to be a lot curlier before I bleached and everything and went through that whole process. So now that my hair is practically back to normal, aside from having to dye over it and stuff, it's been struggling to be curly or whatever. So basically what I'm trying to say is that this thing, this Shea Moisture thing is really good. I've been using it for like about a month and a bit now and it's been really nice. I don't think any of this is right. But <laughs> this is just what I've learned from my YouTube tutorials. So what I'm doing is I'm using my co my cotton thing to uh, to get my hair damp, and then I barely even like touch it because my hair actually I get a good amount. My, it's, that's how much I get for like one side. My hair is very thin though. It's just it's long but it's very thin. And then yeah, I. Do this and then just kind of blend it in if there's any pieces that are. I don't know, it's hard because, like, I, my hair needs product to curl, but then it doesn't curl as not nicely because it's. because it's um, very thin, so it gets weighed, weighed down easily. Um. Girl, you don't know. English, maybe? Nah. It was. What you do to me? Try that? They're not even like. I swear to God, if any curly hair girls are watching this, they're gonna be like, your hair's not even curly. But. It's fine. It used to be curly, I promise. And I've been using my nasty ass old diffuser from like when I was in elementary school. Like it's so old, I swear. But this is usually when I would go in with my normal diffuser, but anyways, my point of this was if you have um, any type of curl or wave, try the Shea Moisture smoothie thing because it's really good. It's hyped up a lot, but it deserves the hype. This is what I've been using as my diffuser, by the way. If you can't see, it has a hair elastic on it, or elastic band, because it broke and won't stay on. I fully just thought that this didn't fit for a second. Oh, thank God. Girl, I fully like didn't know I was supposed to take this off and I just thought it didn't fit my, curl, my uh, blow dryer and I got really scared, so. I also didn't watch any tutorials on how to use that, so I later found out, as you're gonna see, that the elastic was supposed to stay on it so that it wouldn't keep falling off. So, the whole time I was using it, it kept almost falling off and I had to push back on. I was supposed to leave the band on, so. We don't have the cool setting either, so we're just gonna damage my hair some more. <laughs> I just realized it's not even plugged in, guys. Flow, they can make us go and float. Thirty thousand, we won't ever hit below. You a queen, and the world is yours a hoe. Yeah, baby, I got you, and baby, you got me. Tell me how you feeling, just keep it real and promise we'll find peace. My sugar, honey, you're just so great. I wonder, girl, I wonder why you I don't know if you guys saw, but I switched the diffusers. Um. <laughs> I feel like I fully just wasted. I feel like I just wasted forty dollars because that's how much. That's how much that was. So, anyways, my hair. Um, I'm pretty sure. I mean, I'm gonna look it up, but I feel like I maybe need to have a diva hair dryer. Hey guys, so after watching some YouTube videos, I think I was supposed to leave this on so it doesn't keep falling off, which makes sense. So I'm just gonna go over the rest of my hair until it's to see if it works. So here's the hair. Um, you probably can't see it at all. I usually like to blow dry my hair 
till it's like 50% dry and then I'll just let it air dry. But I feel like, I don't know, it's a little bit hard to use, but I'll let you guys know eventually, like in a little bit, after, like in one of my videos, maybe once I've used it a couple times, I'll let you know if it is good. Now guys, this is hard for me to say, but, okay, let me just start quickly from the beginning. I've been seeing this girl all over my TikTok for you page who just constantly tells me that I make money to spend on myself. And so I'm just like, the last few months I've just, I keep seeing all of her TikToks and they're all like, spend your money, spend your money. You work so you can spend your money and buy yourself nice things. And I'm usually all about saving, surprisingly. I'm usually all about my savings and saving money. But this next clip is going to be hard for me to watch. And it's me spending a lot too much money on a pair of shoes. And like I'm happy I did it, but I'm also like that was a lot of money and I probably could have used it towards other things, but okay it's gonna make some cute fits tell me comment down below that um that it's justified spending money on them please that would make me feel a lot better okay guys we're about to do something very exciting it's gonna hurt my bank account but it's gonna be exciting okay guys to do it but I bought the shoes I don't know if you I don't know you can't really even see those but I ordered the size I ordered the Air Jordans retro high retro high stage haze Jordans and they're the first ones I've ever had so I'm nervous I don't know if I got the sizing right and I don't know if they're gonna look good but I've just been wanting a pair of Jordans for so long why wouldn't I get them? But anyways, guys, so that's... I just... I just dropped, like, under $300, which isn't bad for Jordans, but it's just my bank account hurts. My heart hurts. But yeah, guys. I did it. I bought them. They're coming. Um, I'm so excited. So, I'm actually gonna end this video here. It's been a really boring night. Um... Also, look how good my hair, it dried really nice. Look how cute she is. Anyways, um, it's currently 3.54. That's a pretty basic day in my life, um, considering I started this at like 5 p.m. I think. So, you didn't get to see anything in the morning. But I know for a fact if I make this like a week, what I do in my week video, it will be like 30 minutes. And... One, nobody will watch that, and two, I don't want to edit that. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button. I'm probably going to start doing a lot more of these because I'm actually going to be doing stuff this summer. That's the goal. My hand really hurts from holding this. Holy shit. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys next time. I hope you enjoyed.